What is up guys, Tofadina Watches in effect and welcome back to some more WWE 2K23. So I have done an extreme makeover of my character. I think she looks a lot better now. I'll show you guys what she looks like. And I made a new entrance and new victory theme for her. As well as develop some new moves as well. I think you're going to enjoy them a lot. So we're here with Ava Moreno, uh, where we left off last time. So she wants us to be sneaky and attack someone backstage. And try to get them off guard so we could cash in the contract. But as much as I don't want to be sneaky, I mean, even though I like being sneaky, I don't know. Um, I have to go along with it. So for now, I'll just have to do what she says. If it isn't Miss Sneaky, I would say I didn't see you coming, but I totally did. Feel like showing me you're more than just a goody two shoes by proving you can play dirty? Fine, I'll take someone back. I'll take out someone backstage. Fine, but only because I want to get this cash in on the road, not because I need to prove myself to you. Make your briefcase. So, we are just going to have to roll along with it, and hopefully we can maybe become tag team champions. As much as we don't like Ava, if it means having a championship title... That's not Lacey's music, and that's not Lacey Evans. This isn't the scheduled match. Does anyone know what the issue is between these two superstars? Who knows oh, who God. the referee is turning this into a match? Wow. Oh, win the match it's by pinfall or submission. Shotzi's scheduled match against Lacey Evans has been replaced by a match against the insurgent rookie. Apparently, one half of the briefcase holding pair already has a little more swagger in her step after that thrilling tag team money Oh, man. Victory. I was kind of hoping you, it would do my I'm entrance thing. I thought it was going to be like attacking uh -oh, someone backstage. Vicious, vicious arm stop. Ooh, she just turned it around. Oh, well, this is unexpected. Boom, boom, boom. What impact. But anything can happen in the WWE. Delivers the cross. As they say. Referee in position. A kick out after oh, one. man. So, yeah. I hope you like my character's new look. I think she looks more oh. badass. Oh. Okay. Oh. For a Fujiwara arm bar. Oh. Uh, Fujiwara arm bar applied. Pulverizing the arm is a great way to create an advantage. Basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. And Tagiri finds its mark. Taking out the knee. Shotzi oh, she countered. That. Oh, right dear. Ouch. Face. Oh, my gosh. Trap the arm. Into the next oh. Finger. Rip oh, gosh. Oh. Knock him down. And she had Shotzi's number there. Hung in the tree. Whoa! And a well-executed move we just saw there. She might be in some trouble now. They Unbelievable athleticism. Oh, uh, uh, come on. She's come on. Ah. Wiggles free. Nicely done. Got to step up in Zagari. Right in the ear. Mad oh. Slam with some attitude. Oh. That way. And she gets herself out of a precarious position. Kick to the gut. Corkscrew neck breaker. So good. We got a cover. Uh oh. Oh, she went for pasta pin. She kicks out with force. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Great counter impressive ring IQ on display there. Shotzi staggers up, struggling she to make go for the finisher. Exposure. Oh no, she dodged it. Oh, uh, Shotzi manages to counter. Back and forth from these competitors. Whatever you can do. Shotzi kindly requests that you never. Oh my go. gosh. Shotzi got it. She, she got my it? finish. She reversed my finisher. Amazing effort by her. You got to give a lot of credit here. Withstanding what is taken out. Oh my gosh, this is not the way I had things to go well.
Darn it. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Uh. Escape just in time. Release German. She'll need some serious Come on. recovery time after this. Not what you want to see by any means. From the heavens. Good lord. Taking flight. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Oh, come on. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Come on. See if I can get my signature. Oh, my gosh. Oh, she responds with a counter. There's a crucifix. Nicely done. Scratching and clawing. This could be it. There we go. I mean, so yeah, the crucifix is my new signature. The Grim Reaper, LJ. Unquestionably a big win here tonight. This is what it's all about. All the hard work, all the training. It's all for achieving big victories like this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, that's a pretty simple victory. <laughs> I'm just like, you just stare close into my face, and I just like, meh. It is what it is. <laughs> I thought it was perfect. Ah, uh, that was a good match. I like that one. That was really good. All right, so what's next, I wonder? What was that, LJ? Honestly, nothing personal. I was just trying to prove a point about being unexpected. Sorry you were at the under end of it. Oh, man. Shoutsy's not too happy. Oh boy. This may be a bit more difficult than I imagined. All right, Ava, I did what you wanted. Happy now? See, I can be surprising. I don't have to always play by the book. The apology on social media. Uh, I just wanted her to know I didn't have anything against her. I did what you asked, so let's figure out this cash in. Fine. I've got to head out now, but get your lame thoughts in order and we'll talk about it next week. Ugh, you're the worst. Oh my god. She is so damn stubborn. Ah, uh, guess we'll have to just keep going, I guess. Ugh. She really knows how to rain on your parade, that's for sure. Oh, what do we have to do to prove ourselves? Oh, Shoutsy. Oh, man. She's not too happy that we attacked her backstage. Oh, my gosh. Attempt to win by knockout? Oh, God. Oh, man. Why Shoutsy? You know, I'm kind of, I kind of have to say I'm not surprised with her attacking us back, back like that <laughs> after what we did. I actually like Shoutsy. Why did it have to be her of all people? Oh, ouch. Oh, gosh. Oh, God. Oh, what a backstabber. All right, let's see gotta go for a submission move. Come on. Oh. It's too, yeah, it's too difficult. You've really got to wear them down if you want a chance to sub make them submit. Let's get her over here. Can I pick up the traffic cone? Uh, I guess I can't. <laughs> I guess I'll just have to go with the chair. Come on, shout, see where you're going. Oh, she's got a shovel. Oh, Come on. Oh, my gosh. Ow. Oh. Oh, God, that hurt. Oh. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> This is just like, it's so weird. There's like no commentary. There's no, 
like audience reaction, like hearing the backstage audience. Well, not the backstage audience, but the audience roaring from the backstage. It's just like total quietness. <laughs> Ooh, a base is that a baseball bat? Oh, now you're speaking my language. Ooh. Right there. Right on the booty. <laughs> okay. I didn't mean it. It was a joke, okay? <laughs> oh. I am. There we go. The Moonlight Drive. That's what I call that's what they call that one. So we knocked her out. Man, that was weird. Oops, meant to respond to your earlier message, but was too busy planning my own unexpected revenge. When you attack someone for absolutely no reason, better believe it's personal. What do you think would happen? Whose side are you on, Ava? Why don't we settle this in the ring, LJ? No surprises and no DQ. You want to play that way? You know I'm game. You might have to make sure LJ understands the premise of a no DQ. Does she know you can use weapons, or is she too much of a good girl? I know, Ava Marina. And Shoutsy, you're on. Don't worry. I won't play nice. Okay, so now we have to face Shoutsy again, this time in a no DQ match. <laughs> That's going to be interesting. Oh boy, this thing goes on f for days, I tell ya. What's in store for us, I wonder? Oh, now we can finally see my new entrance. It's the second generation superstar who's here to write her own story. Oh, this is gonna be epic. Look at the, the entrance is called Dark Ritual. You see all the candles. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making and you see me rise Rangers up. From Victoria, Texas, the Grim Reaper, LJ. This young superstar really is the complete package. She's got power, determination, grace. Apparently dirt on you, Saxton. Give it a rest. She still has a lot to prove. Dun 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 dun. I wish I could turn. I wish I could show you guys the music I chose for her. But yeah, I still hate the fact that I have to avoid. I have to avoid copyrights. So, again, it is what it is. Oh yes. Oh yeah. This is a woman ready to do some damage. Oh, man. I don't know. I just thought it was cool looking. Just like shows no emotion. <laughs> oh, yeah. I am ready for action. This is... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so yeah, that was pretty much my entrance. <laughs> and there comes Shoutsy. Well, this is a true ballsy entrance. And from Oakland, California, Shoutsy! unique women superstars in history but she has quickly grown in popularity yeah and quickly earned success too michael shotzi's a former nxt tag team champion and nearly defeated ronda rousey for the smackdown women's title <laughs> oh yeah she always makes an entrance in that big tank i remember when she had a rivalry going on with uh candice LeRae, and um when when Shoutsy had cost Candice LeRae a shot at the NXT Championship, um, Candice LeRae got in her car, our truck, and she and she uh, ran over Shoutsy's tank. <laughs> Shoutsy was like completely devastated. Oh man, it feels so long ago since I watched that. 
I've actually been trying to watch the WWE episodes in chronological order. I think I was on... I started in 1993 from the very first Monday Night Raw. And so far, after all these years, I'm at 2015. And I kind of stopped at that point because I was trying to... I was trying to uh, catch up so I could watch everything from the beginning. Which was really cool because it was really fun watching some of the old pay-per-views and old shows they used to have during the series because I watched a lot of I watched a lot of WCW too before WWE fought them out it was really fun but no I stopped watching just because I was trying to save financially because I had to subscribe to that Peacock streaming show oh my god you don't aim for the apron unless you're looking to do some serious damage and she slides her back to the Oh, mat. my gosh. Okay, enough talk. I got to focus here. She did her homework there. Oh, a step up in Zagari. Okay. She's taking this outside. This one cannot be lost by count out. Got to get the baseball bat. And now she's getting back into the ring. Side kick. Oh, I have to. Oh, I have to do it outside the ring. Shotzi able to avoid impact. Oh, man. Mark. Oh, step up in Zagari, right in the <laughs> ear. Oh my gosh. Counters that. Oh my god. And she's thinking of recovering now. Still time to run away if she wants to. Oh. Oh. Irish whip Shoutsy into the stairs. Oh. And each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taking a toll. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed. Irish whip Shoutsy into the stairs. Okay. If I could get her. And Shoutsy reverses it. Oh, come on. Into the barricade. <laughs> oh. No what she'll find under the ring here. Ah. Oh. She was looking for the great equalizer. And she found it in the steel chair. Boom. Head first. Come on, I'm gonna bring you over here. Right to the face. Okay, I gotta Irish her into the stairs. There we go. Alright, what's next? Stop shout seeing our tracks outside the ring with a stop sign. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. Attack Shotzi with a kendo she's stick while face. in the ring. Oh, man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. She's rummaging around under the ring here. Oh, yeah. I can feel the sting of the kendo stick, and I do not care for it. Setting foot in the ring now. We're seeing the same aggression here that we saw during that pre Oh, cutscene. It's Raquel Rodriguez. Apparently, she's not a fan of how Shotzi was used to prove a point. Raquel and Shotzi haven't always seen eye to eye, but these two came up together in NXT. I guess that counts for something. Either that or she just wanted in on the fun of this no DQ match. All this is perfectly legal. And so was that. Ava Marino from behind. This team may not have cashed it in yet, but that briefcase is proving to be pretty handy. Shotzi with a roll up. Ava slides the briefcase in, and she nails Shotzi. Oh, God. She got the win. I guess the briefcase did turn out to be the determining factor in this match. And some teamwork, too. Something that we haven't seen yet from this pairing. They may not have chosen each other initially, but maybe this tag team does have what it takes to make good on the promise of that Money in the Bank briefcase. Okay. You know, I wasn't really expecting Ava to show up. I really thought she was just going to leave me getting pummeled by Shoutsy and Raquel Rodriguez. I'm kind of actually surprised. I'm kind of actually surprised she would take the time to help me, so I guess I should thank her, maybe? Huh. It's hard to say what she's thinking at this moment. Oh, boy. What did decisions, decisions. 
That was unexpected. You defending me in the ring? Certainly was. I was talking about Raquel. We're tag team partners. It's not like I don't like you. You have literally told me before that you don't like me, Ava. Fair point. But I didn't know you. You were just some new girl coming in to take my spot. I wasn't trying to take anyone's spot. I was trying to start my career. Sure. But your journey to WWE was very different than mine. You started with the WWE legend in the family. Your support system was in the business already. You even knew some of the crew. I had none of that. Things have always been harder for me, and it was difficult seeing you get an opportunity right off the bat. <laughs> Did it help that I crashed and burned in my debut? <laughs> it certainly did not hurt. I can't control what family I was born into any more than you can. We're bound to have different perspectives and experiences. You're right. Probably explains why I find some of the stuff you do so annoying. You know, besides just the fact that you're the entitled niece of a legend. <laughs> you're just kinda mean generally, huh? See? Now we're really getting to know each other. Which is actually a good thing if we're going to work together on this cash-in. Let's finally have that talk and figure out how we're going to do it. Speaking of... Ava, where's the briefcase? I thought you had it. No, I don't. You don't know where it is? I... do not. Well, this is not great. Uh-oh. Sounds like we've misplaced our briefcase. What are we going to do? Oh, what to do, what to do. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is very, very bad. Did someone steal it? Was it Chelsea or was it Raquel? Exciting new development. Raquel and I are the proud new owners of the tag team money debris. As in, we're holding it right now. Probably should have kept a better eye on it. That's not yours. What's that thing they say? Possession is nine to ten. Possession is nine to ten. Nine tenths of the law. Oh, I knew it was them. They took our briefcase. Oh, boy. Oh, you're not going to get away with this. Molly and Ava. Let's see what Molly has we to say. We need you to go to Shotzi and Raquel and tell them to give our briefcase back. They're not listening to us. Hate to say it, guys, but WWE briefcase law has always been pretty vague. I'm not sure if possession is nine-tenths of the law, but it's certainly a fractional value of some sort. But they stole it from us! Stole it! Ava, I'd expect you of all people to understand a bit of deviousness. But both of you, save your breath. A decision has already been made. WWE management has decreed that you'll face them for the briefcase in a match next week. That's not fair, Molly. Didn't say it was, but that's what's happening. Then we're going to use everything at our disposal to make sure they never try anything like this ever again. Oh, it's on now. They took our briefcase, and so now we gotta get it back. Shoutsy, I will be placed, officially take the tag team major off LJ and Ava hands next week. The first step in our next tag team championship. But we're not gonna be like you two and just carelessly leave the briefcase out ringside to steal back. We're not idiots. The briefcase will be hidden in the same place until after we win. No chance of you winning. I won't be holding back. I feel bad for you guys, because I actually believe her. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You think you could just take our briefcase and not get away with it? And, or, I mean, get away with it? Oh, I gotta work on my puns. I gotta work on my catch comeback phrases. I'm so bad at this. <laughs> this All wrestler right. grew up in the business, and now she's growing up before our very eyes. Oh, man. I so love my entrance.
The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from Victoria, Texas, the Grim Reaper, LJ. The moment this match was announced, the WWE Universe has expected a classic. I think it is destined to deliver. Oh, man. It's so awesome watching my entrance. <laughs> but alas, I at least got to show you guys what it looks like first. Oh, yeah. I might change the jacket. The jacket's kind of... I don't know. I think this maybe I should get a better jacket. Star looks to finish on top in this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and skip the rest of that. <laughs> All right, so we're in a tag match, I believe. Yes, Ava Moreno. Tireless and fearless, it's Ava Moreno. And her partner from the Bronx, New York, Ava Moreno. Ava Moreno is strong and very determined. And don't let that grin fool you. Behind her smile, you can see she is a volcano just waiting to erupt. It's a dangerous combination, Saxton. Speed, power, focus. It makes you wonder what she's missing that kept her from getting more opportunities. Oh, uh, yeah. Buckle up, Ava Moreno is about to throw down like only she can. I believe it. Big, bad, and ready to brawl. Raquel and Rodriguez. From Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. Think about the incredible resume of Raquel Rodriguez. In her first three years, she's been an NXT Women's Tag Team Champion. A Dusty Rhodes Classic winner, an NXT Women's Champion, and a WWE Women's Tag Team Champion. Oh boy. This is not going to be an easy task, I'll tell you that right now. The personification of dominance in NXT and WWE since day one. Yeah, and I think we can all agree that Raquel Rodriguez is getting better with every match. Even when she makes short work of her opponent. <laughs> and then, of course, there's Shoutsy Blackheart. Well, this is a true ballsy entrance. Shotzi had a long and arduous road to get to WWE, but now she's enjoying herself. Well, any road's going to be long if you're driving a tank that slowly. <laughs> All righty, it's time to get this match on the road. After a shocking turn of events, Ava Moreno and her partner's Money in the Bank briefcase set the tone by damaging Raquel as Shotzi either LJ or Ava. It's not technically in the air because its new owners, Shotzi and Raquel, have refused to disclose its whereabouts. Although I guess it, it could be in the air somewhere. Thanks, Saxton. You should have been a detective. <laughs> Hurricanrana, ideal meal. Targeting the neck. Right neck breaker. The neck. This onrush has got to be draining Rodriguez. Raquel's got to start turning the tide somehow. All right, got that done. What's next? Take Shotzi head on with the front running grapple as either LG or Ava. So she tags in. Big boot. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to hurt. Just a barrage of elbow drops into the chest. Ouch. And what a maneuver we just saw there. 
Oh god. Oh boy. Oh no, a double team. Oh, jeez. Ava interrupts the attack. Frankensteiner. Nice. As LJ hits Shelsey with a sterling strike while in the ring. Target acquired and destroyed. Oh gosh. Ow. She's able to get the tag by the skin of her teeth. Shotzi ducks, nails a discus forearm. This could be the moment that officially puts the briefcase in the hands of Shotzi and Raquel. What's Shotzi doing? It's the stolen Money in the Bank briefcase. It said it was in a safe place. I guess the safe place was under the ring, Byron. The original briefcase winner counters. She's the one who's taking advantage of the referee distraction now. This match is over. Yeah. Over, but that's probably not the ending Shotzi and Raquel had in mind. And the ownership of the Money in the Bank briefcase is officially returned to the original winners. Hopefully now they can put this behind them and officially set their sights on cashing in for the Tag Team Championships. At the very least, I bet they'll keep better track of the briefcase from now on. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It's a nice little cutscene. At least that it didn't take too long, because I know those tag the last video, those tag matches that I was in took forever. And that money in the bank ladder match, well that was a good way to end it, because that match took a long time to do, and it was really fun. I enjoy it a lot. So don't be surprised if there's like a whole bunch of episodes for this series. Ah, <laughs> oh, we did it! We got our briefcase back. Nothing new on social media, so we might as well see what Ava Marino says. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> and look how far you've come. Got the timing right this time, and the ref didn't see a thing. If you had used the chair that fast in our match, I would have been done. Oh, fighting dirty is, uh... Fighting dirty is fun. I will admit, fighting a little dirty is a good time. You may have had a point. That's my girl. Knew there was a little rebel in you, LJ. And now that's settled, we still need to decide how we're cashing in our briefcase. Our? Nice. And it's about time we finally have this conversation. But who gets to decide how we do it? You want to face me in the ring again? Whoever wins gets to call the shots. I'm ready. Nah. Now when I'm starting to think you might not be the worst person ever. Generous. <laughs> Let's take out our aggression on other people who are arguably worse than you. A beat the clock challenge. One of us takes Raquel, one of us takes Shotzi. Whoever wins faster gets to decide how we cash in. Interesting, a beat the clock challenge. I think, I, you know, I've faced Shoutsy lots of times. I've faced her lots of times, so I think I'm going to change it up. I'm going to face Raquel. I love it. I'll face Raquel. Then I'll take Shotzi. Best of luck, partner. Ah, we're actually getting along. That's a pretty good sign. <laughs> oh, oh. But we still have to be cautious. I don't know. I feel like Ava Moreno might have her own scheme. But I don't know. Maybe it's too early. I don't think so. From the way she sounds, she's starting to like us. So that's a good sign. Oh, yes. It's the superstar who's driven to live up to all the hype. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Victoria, Texas, the Grim Reaper, LJ. For a young second generation superstar like this, each match isn't just a battle against her opponent, it's a battle to create her own legacy. 
She's got all the tools, Corey. Now we get to see what she does with them. All right. Well, as much as I would love to watch my character's entrance again, I'm going to go ahead and skip it. Just so we can get straight to the point. And I think I'll go ahead and skip Raquel's too, just so we can get this match underway. After the sooner the better. Stolen briefcase in a tag team match. Abel Moreno's partner is now facing Raquel Rodriguez. So we got to be here in three minutes tonight. and 47 Abel seconds. Maybe they wanted to teach Raquel and Shotzi individual lessons about stealing? It feels like something other than morality is at play here, especially since these teammates have decided to turn this into a beat the clock challenge. And Ava's set a tough time to beat at three minutes and 47 seconds. This has been such a back and forth matchup. She looks like she's willing to do anything to end oh, this. Oh, what thing. are we doing? Oh. She may have to. These two have battled back and forth, thrown everything they have at one another. But what on earth is next? Come on, what are we doing here? What could she possibly be thinking? All the way to the top! Ah! When all else fails, nice. sometimes you just have to go the high risk and hopefully high reward route. Unbelievable athleticism! <laughs> Into the armbar! That was amazing! Oh. What's gonna happen? Oh. Wiggles free, nicely done! Close line! Off with their head. That should keep her head in the game. Oh, wiped out with the crossbody. That offense taking a toll on her. Oh, what impact. Come on. Oh, yeah. She has a really good. Oh, man. Two up. minutes, 18 seconds. This is not the time to be diverting attention away from your opponent. Come on. Come on. There's a tilt a whirl into the backstabber. I don't know who's feeling this more. Her or Come the on. crowd. Kick to the gut. Oh, and a corkscrew neck breaker. All right, let's Rodriguez see if we go for the finisher. See if we can get her. Put back down for good. Uh oh. Don't matter. No way Raquel's getting up now. There's two. Yes. Work. Dark Here's matter. The Grim Reaper, LJ. What an emphatic victory, guys. No contest. <laughs> Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. Not lopsided as they come. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was only just like that because I was trying to beat the clock. If we weren't against the clock, I would have taken my time. Try to make the match a little more interesting. But it is what it is. I hate making matches one-sided, but had to do what I had to. All right. So now that I beat the clock, I get to decide when to cash in. So it's agreed. The deal's the deal. You beat my time of 347. Whenever you want to make a move with the briefcase for the tag team championships, let me know. The decision is yours. And I'll use it wisely. Indeed. Yes. We did it. All right. Continue the story. All right. So we get to decide when the when we get to decide to cash in. Ooh. When will we cash in the championships? Let's see. Oh. Make your brief case. Completed. Haha. <laughs> All right. Why do you think LJ and Ava are wasting their time with the Beat the Clock Challenge? I thought they'd be cashing in on us. They are scared. I would be too. Oh, just you wait. Your time will come. Your time will come soon enough. Okay. I can upgrade. I can upgrade a bit. Let's see what Ava has to say. 
I'm good to go if you're ready to cash in the briefcase for our tag team championship match. You won the right to decide what we're doing, after all. I'm ready. I'm ready. No time like the present to become champions, right? But I've been thinking, as the first ever tag team briefcase holders, we need to make our cash in memorable. Something that WWE Universe will be talking about for years to come. I could not agree more. I don't want to just win the championships. I want us to be in the WWE Best Money in the Bank Cash in Highlight video. What are you thinking? I have two ideas. Both guaranteed to catch the champions off guard, excite the WWE Universe, and get us in that video. We could pretend to lose the briefcase again and accuse Asuka and Tamina of stealing it. That would give an enterprising tag team an opportunity to strike. Especially if they found some extra security guard uniforms lying around. Interested? What's the other idea? Ever notice how the refs never actually open the briefcase to make sure the contract's inside? I think we can use that to our advantage and fake the champions out. I love the way your brain works. I'm down for either. What do you want to do? You won the choice. So it's yours. Whoa. Lose the briefcase again or briefcase fake out. Oh, it's decision time. These arrows that are showing will decide which way. Let's see. Do we want to lose the briefcase again? Or do we want to do a briefcase fake out? I'm guessing maybe like using a fake briefcase. In pl a fake briefcase or lose the briefcase again hmm oh decision time decision time for both of us <laughs> okay you know what I'm feeling a little mischievous so let's do let's do lose the briefcase again um oh gosh let's do oh my gosh i, I I'm, <laughs> I'm quivering i don't know what to select <laughs> oh gosh um ah oh, why am i so hesitant on making a decision oh god um let's do Let's do briefcase fake out. That sounds awesome. Like, we'll come in and we'll think we're cashing it in, but there's, like, no contract inside. But then we'll come out with a real championship and, and use that. Or losing the briefcase and we'll attempt to steal it. Oh, boy. Um, oh, my God. Both of these ideas are good. Oh, gosh. Okay. I need to make a decision now for the flavor. Um, a briefcase fake out. Let's fake them out with an empty briefcase. About time there were consequences for the refs not being thorough enough. I love consequences where we end up as champions. Okay. Women's security jacket. Unlikely partners. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Uh, yeah. Let's go along with that. Maybe I'll try losing the briefcase again next time, but... We've already made our decision, so it is what it is. Oh, man. Oh, good Lord. Whew. What's going to happen, I wonder? We have a great matchup in store tonight as the tag champs will be taking on Nikki A.S.H. and her formidable partner. Hold on one second. These two aren't in tonight's matchup, but they've got the Money in the Bank briefcase. Looks like they're casting in for the tag team title match right now. Seriously? That's it? No deception? Just interrupt the scheduled match? Maybe they didn't think they needed any of that. Yeah. <laughs> it's official. The first ever tag team briefcase is being cashed in. I don't know if it's the best cash in strategy, but it's a strategy. We'll have to see if it pays off. Oh yeah, it's go time. Tag team match is underway. How long did they 
they spend coming up with this plan. Because run down and cash in before the champs have competed, it's not very creative. Oh, yeah. I've seen more calculating cash ins in my day, but if they walk out of champions, <laughs> oh, yeah. We got that this. Was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. And Let's see if I can go for submission. Tensions coming with this hole. You feel like hope is starting to fade away. They're able to shift their weight and escapes. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Asuka's being overwhelmed. Asuka's certainly being tested here. All right, time to switch it up. Now we got to wear Tamina down. The power of a deadlift Ooh, into a look military at that. press. Wow. Walking around the ring. Oh, the you want to bitch slap me? These hits. Quick thinking pays off. Oh, man. Naturally, Tamina going the intimidation route. Oh, she reversed it. For the title. She is still very much in this. Come on. Oh my gosh. I don't stop anybody. Come on, Asuka. What you got? I got to get her to tag in Tamina. Just hot shot it to the outside. Oh, man. Letting her opponent know she uh -oh. is ready for anything. <laughs> oh, oh, somersault flip. Now that's what you call impact. Get her back in here. Uh, sling blade. I'm going to have to switch over. Drop kick. Counter from Tamina. Okay. Across the top rope, come. all the way to the floor. Oh, come on. Impressive reversal there. These two trading counters and an absolute master class. All right, there we go. Now we got to get her back in there. And now thrown back into the ring. Oh, yeah. See oh, geez. I didn't so I expect her to recover so quickly. Oh, gosh. Power from the suplex. That's got to be it. Wow. All right. Now she's got Tamina tagged in. There we go. Ooh. Drops the hammer. Right Come on. Lower back. Frankensteiner. Nice. We're getting close. Champ taking the worst end of the exchange. All right, now what? As LJ grapple Oscar while in the ring. Thunderous power slam. Ava is taking full command here. I don't think anything can stop it. Oh, get ready. She knows exactly what she's doing with this submission hold. Oh, oh yeah. Twisting the body. I'm not sure there's anything she could. Oh, serious peril. No, she counters. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, gosh. Ow. There we go. Got to grapple Asuka. Up and around, down with a tilt the world backbreaker. Okay, come on. She's there we go. For a suplex on the tag team champion. Wait, what is Nikki Ash doing here? Well, apparently, she's not happy that her tag team championship match was stolen. And now she's going to ruin it for the challengers. The referee's throwing the match out. The match might be over, but it seems like the now former briefcase holders have something to say. Nikki A.S.H. We had one chance to cash in our Money in the Bank contract, and you ruined it! Is what I would say if I didn't ask Nikki to do that. Wait a second, what did she say? You might be wondering. Why would we ask someone to interfere and cause a disqualification during our hard-won championship opportunity? I would be wondering that. But in truth, I have never been so happy that Nikki interfered and attacked the champions, which would make them a little bit more vulnerable if they were to have to compete again tonight. And I have never been so pleased that WWE referees never 
look inside the briefcase to verify a cash-in. There's no contract inside. And without the contract, that's just an ordinary briefcase. That wasn't our cash-in. This is. I thought their cash-in strategy was suspect, but I take it back. This is genius. I agree, a masterful plan and a great execution from the challengers. But will it be enough? If all that doesn't throw the tag champs off their game, I don't know what will. Oh, we got him on the ropes this time. <laughs> Defeat Oscar Tamina for the tag team champions. The back of the neck here. Oh my God, that was such an ingenious plan. Oh God, I pressed the wrong button. What a smash! That, that was such an ingenious plan. Let's do it. How effective! She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Come on. Check that out. Corkscrew neck breaker. So good. Oh, yeah. Boom. Come on. Tamina now is See if I go for the up. finisher. We did it! Women's Tag Team Champions! And what a cash in! Its theatricality was only exceeded by the skill these two competitors showed in the ring. Does that mean these two superstars and champions are finally on the same page? At least yeah. Saxon. And it looks like the new champs are soaking in every moment of this championship celebration. And after what they faced to get here, mostly each other, they deserve it. We did it! We're the Tag Team Champions! Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Oh, wow! Yes, that was amazing. Oh, wow. Okay, congratulations. I'm so proud of you. I'm so sorry I couldn't be there to witness your victory. I've had a lot of opponents recently, business stuff. I actually headed to Philly this weekend. Thank you, no worries. Would have kind of defeated the purpose of the surprise cash if I'd given you advance notice. But what do you think? Honestly, perfect, unexpected, and wonderful. I'm so happy to see you finding your voice and your place in WWE. Aw, love hearts. Even Justine's proud of us. I love it. Oh, it's nice to have the tag team champions. It's nice to have some gold around our waist. I love it. All right. So, what's next, I wonder? What's going to happen now? Unlikely partners. Story is completed. Oh. The champs are here. Oh, look at this. Parking not. Oh, my God. Look at all these missions. Hot take on a hot mic. Nikki's exes. Powers for Algernon? Oh my gosh, there's so many. There's so many. Wow. Unjust, unfair, unacceptable. Oh, Asuka's mad too. <laughs> oh, they're mad. A money in the bank casher for the history books and new women's tag team champions LJ and Ava Moreno. Game respects game. <laughs> wow. And want to wish a major congrats to the winner of the Miss WWE Universe crown given to the most beautiful, competent, graceful superstar in WWE. Thank you to all the runners out, basically everyone else. I wear the crown with pride. Congratulations. I had a feeling you two could get it together. Looking forward to working with the two of you as tag team champions. Oh, yeah. Congrats, kid. It's well enough to see you as a WWE superstar and now champion. First of many, I'm sure. Uh, thanks, Tom. Appreciate ya. Nikki Ash. Glad it worked out for you two tonight. Pretty rad to be a part of a moment that is already breaking records on WWE social media. Uh, thanks, Nikki. We did what we set out to do, both in terms of making a statement and when you came, couldn't have done it without you. Just remember our deal. I expect an opportunity of my own for those tag team titles. Just give us this moment to celebrate first, okay? Absolutely. All right, 
So, I can't upgrade anything. Oh, wait, there's something else. Oh, yeah, it was this one. Oh, gosh. Congrats, Carmella. I had no idea the concert was going on. It's a real pageant, right? If you've never heard of it, it's only because you don't have what it takes to wear the crown. I promise you, if you're worthy of it, then it's probably beneath it. And it's that kind of talk that proves my point. You're missing out on many golden opportunities given to the winner. Like what? Preferred parking, marking matches, title shots. I'd be happy to help coach you and get you ready for next year's competition in February. This is clearly made up, so... This is clearly made up, so no way. Okay, well, I may have to try that next time because it seems as though we've got a whole lot more to do. We've got a whole bunch of new stuff to do. Oh my gosh. I'm not sure how this is going to fare off for next time, but we're going to have to wait and see what happens. So, I don't know. I may have to do... I didn't think there was going to be this much. I thought there was only going to be like two or three, but there's going to be like a whole bunch of them. Um, so, I don't know yet. I think maybe I'll try to see what I can do for the in the meantime. And it depends on, like, where these actually go, since these are all, like, side objectives. So, yep, I guess we've got a long way ahead of us. So, there'll be plenty more action to come soon. Oh, Ava Moreno, my tag team champion partner, and Sonya Deville. So, yeah, there's definitely going to be a lot more to this than we thought, so... That just means more opportunities for us to explore. So I might do a little bit more digging around. Maybe try to do a few of these on my own. Uh, just to save a little bit of video time. But I'll have to wait and see what happens until then. So um, I'm not sure if I'll be able to include all the side missions. You know, I remember I mentioned before I was going to try and keep all the side missions shown in the video. But keep all like the fit the challenge quests. I might... Uh, I'll pretty much try to do those, and then I'll see where that goes for everything else as well. So, I'll wait and see what happens until then. But I hope, but for now, thanks again so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any new videos of mine. And also, you may have noticed that um, I didn't have my usual entrance and um, my usual entrance and exit outro for the video, like when it shows my name. And then it says, and then it's me saying, hi, what's up? You know, um, that's mainly because that I ran out of time to record. So I didn't have time to uh, edit the video to like include those. So this is kind of a weird video because I really wanted to get a video up before because um, I have to work tonight at my other job, unfortunately. So by the time this is uploaded, if you notice there's no outro to this, then yeah, it's basically meaning, yeah, I didn't get time to um, include those. So I mean, but I figured it would be better to do it that way, just upload it right away without having to edit the intro and outro, just so I could get it out by today rather than wait till I got home later in the day tomorrow and then upload it then. So, so you're welcome. I at least got this up for you guys. So I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> but for now, guys, until then, I'll decide what to do for the next step for the story. So we'll see what happens at that point. So... For now, thanks again so much for watching, guys. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Ta-ta for now.